Hi everyone, I hope you're well. Welcome to week two of Fitness Fridays. I really hope that you enjoyed last week's episode and that you felt really energized for the rest of your day. So we're gonna be doing a similar thing this week. We're gonna be working for 35 seconds and having 25 seconds rest. However, we're gonna change some of the exercises to keep some variation and to keep you as energized as possible for the rest of your day. So what we're gonna do this week is we're gonna start with some running punches. We're gonna then do some sit down toe touches. We're gonna to do some star jumps. Then we're gonna do some squat jumps. Then we're gonna do something called mummy kicks, which you might have come across. Then we're gonna be doing a lunge, lunge, squat, squat. So we're really working on our legs today and really energizing and getting the most out of our legs. Then we're gonna do some mountain climbers and work our core. Then we're gonna do finishing, uh, be finishing, sorry, with some sprinting on the spot. But before we start, I'm just gonna show you how to do a couple of the exercises so that when we do start, you're not confused as to what to do. So the ones I wanted to talk you through are the sit down toe touch to start off with. So what you'll be doing when you do that exercise is, exercise rather, you'll be going down to the floor, touching your toes and jumping back up. And that is one sit down toe touch, okay? So you're going down, touching your toes, and a big, powerful squat up. The other one I wanted to show you was the mountain climbers, which we're gonna be doing at the end of, um, I think it's our, our, our second to last exercise that we're gonna be doing. And that's something that you use to work your core. Now, it's a really good exercise if you get it right, but you've gotta make sure that you get it right, okay? So I don't want anyone to get injured. But it's quite an easy one. So what you're gonna be doing is you go down into a press up position like this, okay? Nice straight back, like you can see mine is. And what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna be raising your knees up to your chest, one at a time. So you're gonna be going one, two, three, four. Now, we're not gonna to go too fast, because I want people to get used to the exercise, but it's a really one, good one, and it really gets your heart rate up. Okay, so without further ado, I'm gonna get my trusty hit timer going, my Fitness Fridays timer, and we're gonna get going. So we're gonna be starting with our running punches. And as always, we get a nice 15 second uh, preparation time to get us ready. So we're gonna start in a nice neutral position. And when we hear our countdown, we're gonna go three, two, one, and we're gonna get straight into our running punches. Okay, let's go. So we're gonna be pumping our legs like this, and punching forwards, okay? Get those knees nice and high. This is a really good way to get our heart rates going before we go into our next exercise. We're gonna get ourselves nice and energized for the rest of the day. 10 seconds to go, so from the side, pump those legs, get them up. Okay, pump those arms out, really work those arms on the front to the other side. Okay, we're nearly there, about five seconds to go. Keep punching, keep punching, keep punching. Two, one, and stop there, okay. Good effort, so I've already got my heart rate up, I hope yours is up too. So the next exercise, like I showed you earlier, is gonna be the sit down toe touch. So remember, we're gonna be going down, sitting down, touching our toes, coming back up into a nice big jump. And that'll be one, and we're gonna be 35 seconds again. So we just wait for our timer. Two, one, go. So down, touch the toes, back up, big jump. Okay, that's one, keep going. Touch toes, back up, and jump. Down, touch the toes. Remember to touch those toes, keep going. And up, and down. Touch those toes, back in, and up. Let's get a few more. Down, keep going. Touch the toes, and up. Oh, this is a good one. Down, touch the toes. Three seconds, and up, okay. Good work, really good work. Keep that going. Get some water if you've got some. Have a quick drink. Get your breath back and get ready to move on to star jump. So we all know how to do a star jump. Very simply like that, okay? We'll all do them together. Let's get our breath back and let's get ready to move on to the next exercise. Three seconds, two seconds, one second, and go. Okay, so doing star jumps. See how many we can do. In our 35 seconds. You don't have to go at my pace, you can go slower or you can go faster if you think you can go faster. But make sure we're really reaching our arms up to the top, getting our legs out wide, 
and bouncing off the balls of our feet, okay? So we don't want to be jumping forwards and backwards. We want to be staying in a neutral position, but really working our arms and legs, getting our heart rate up. Five seconds to go. Keep going. Really good effort, everyone. And stop. Wow, that was a good one. That was a really good one. Okay, next up, we're doing our squat jumps, okay? So that's another really simple one, but it's a really good one to work your legs and get nice and powerful. So we're quite literally, it's similar to our frog jumps that we did last week, down into a squat and up. And really power through our legs, okay? So down into the squat and up. Okay, we've got three seconds to go. Two, one, and down and up. Okay, really powerful, keep going. Down and up, okay, from the side, keep going. Make look at me, how am I doing? Down and up, okay? From the front again, we're gonna go down, really power through our legs. Imagine you're jumping up to touch the sky. Down and up, okay? Good effort from the other side, okay? Feet shoulder width apart, down and up, okay? Keep going, don't stop now. Keep going, we're nearly there, five seconds. Down and up. If you can't do the jump, that's okay. Just do squats like that, okay? Nearly there. Okay, good effort. This is a really good one. I feel really energized in my day already. I'm really enjoying this one. Okay, next up are mummy kicks. Put your hands out. Imagine you're a mummy. What do you want me to do? I don't know. Anyway, you're gonna put your hands out and we're gonna kick like that. Okay, we're gonna kick out like that, okay? We're gonna stay on the balls of our feet. Okay, ready? Go! Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ten. Pretend to be a mummy if you want. Ooh. And from the side. Okay, get those legs. Get those legs working. Get your heart rate up. Get ready for that first lesson of the day. Whew. Good effort, everyone. Keep going. So remember, keep those arms out. Probably feel it in your shoulders a little bit. But keep going. We're nearly there. Ten seconds to go. Woo! This is a good one. It's making me tired, this one. Two seconds, and break. Okay, now, wow, I'm quite tired already. Okay, right, so the next one is, we are going to lunge, lunge, squat, and squat. Okay, that's one. Lunge, lunge, squat, squat. Lunge, lunge, squat, squat. Five seconds rest. Three, two, one, and go. Lunge. Lunge, squat, and squat. Okay, lunge, and lunge, and squat, and squat. Well done, now straight back. Lunge, and lunge, and in. Squat, nice big deep squat, and squat. Okay, remember to keep that core nice and tight as well. Keep going, super job, one more to go, let's go. Lunge. Squat, woo, squat, oh, that is a great leg burner, keep going. So, we are onto our mountain climbers. Remember, you want to get into the press-up position, keep a nice straight back, and raise your legs individually up to your chest. I don't think anyone can do two legs at once. Okay, so I'm gonna get ready. We've got a little four to start off with. Three seconds, press-up position. Okay, one. Two, three, nice straight back. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Keep going, we're nearly there. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, nearly there. Two, from the front, so it looks like. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Well done. Oh, sorry, I've appeared up close to that camera. My battery nearly died. Okay, last one, team. You're doing such a great job. We're going to finish with a big burnout, a big cardio burner. Get our hearts nice and pumped up and ready and full of blood and full of oxygen, ready for the day. We're going to sprint on the spot. We're not going to jog. We're going to sprint on the spot. Two seconds. One second. Go. Okay. Yeah. Get those knees nice and high, pump those arms, see how fast you can go. Try not to back into anything at home or in your classrooms. Keep going, 20 seconds to go. Really good effort, get those knees nice and high. 
Get on those knees, nice and high. You're in the final 50 meters of your 100 meter sprint. Don't stop now. We're nearly there. Come on, team. Keep going. Keep going. Five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Well done. Well, well done. A nice roar from the crowd there. Whew. So, that was Fitness Fridays number two. And if you're as burnt out and as tired as I am, you've done a fantastic job. So same as last week, what I'll do is I will attach a Word document or a Google document with that. So if you want to, you can try it at home um, and you can try some of the challenges that I've attached as well. And that should be quite good fun. Hope you're really enjoying these. I hope you get nice and energized for the rest of your day. As always, have a fantastic weekend. Really enjoy yourselves, okay? Keep going, you're doing really, really well. We're all really proud of you at Chandlings. So keep your heads up high, keep smiling, keep working out, and all will be okay. I will see you next week for Fitness Fridays, number three. Have a good one, guys, bye.